Yes, okay then. Those were the black crows who uh, weren't half bad, were they? They weren't as good as this, though, were they? No, they weren't as kick butty in the rock and roll stakes as that, Mike. You're right. Yeah, okay, that's fine, that's fine. But listen, apart from it being all fun and frivolity and showbiz and peace, love and pit bulls and all that kind of thing, uh, of course, there's also current affairs. And we go over for a news flash to our news desk now. Doodle -doodle 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 yes, of course. <laughs> Yesterday we had some devastating news about John Major resigning as the leader of the Conservative Party. And yet he will be reinstated. Who knows? Keith Allen was the Rover reporter around the site to ask people what they thought. Yeah, and he went there. No, he went there. And he went there. What are you talking about? You don't know where. He might have stayed in the same. But you're not on the radio now, Radcliffe. No, it's rambling. Making it up. Just watch it, okay? Well, he was over there. Just watch the piece. Yo, respect to the nation. Good vibration. Keith's on a vibe line with a major message for the man called John. What are you doing this weekend? Because you're not ruining the country, are you? Just joking. My name is Mike Cocaine. No, it's not. My name is Keith Allen. And here I am, John, aboard one of the great flagships of free enterprise culture. And I'm going nowhere. Because I don't need to, John. I'm here. This is Glastonbury. The place where they say airline pilots reroute just on the off chance of getting a whiff in their air conditioning systems. Where they say if you don't shave for four or five days and you go back to London or wherever you live, then shave and keep your hairs in a little glass, you'll never have to buy illegal substances again, ever. You just look at them. John, this is Glastonbury. This is a festival. But for a person like you, it's probably a constituency. There's 600 acres, there's about 180,000 people. It's quite a fair to large town. Let's go and find out if you stood for parliament here, what the people think about you, see if you've got a chance. Look at the police, everything's here, you'll love it. There are no dole queues, we've got policemen. Ugh, oh, Tory dream. Do you know who John Major is? Yes. Yeah. Do you know yeah. he's resigned? Yeah. yeah. How do you feel about that? Look at the camera. Excellent. Good, good, good. 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 Sorry, John. <laughs> what do you think about John Major resigning? I didn't know he had. <laughs> <laughs> Got a vote there, John. Oh, Excuse me. Seen it. Just have a quick word. Do you what know where the Merry Christmas are? <laughs> yeah, just up yeah, there. Yeah, what? You know who John Major is? Yeah. Look at that. Yes. He's just resigned. How do you feel? <laughs> have you ever heard of John Major? Unfortunately, yeah. You know he's just resigned? Has he? Hello, John, yeah. possibly another. Yeah, he's resigned. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and Douglas Heard. Oh, well, we can dream. How do you feel? Dream. Elated. You feel? I'm elated. John, it's not working. Do you know something? I bet you're a nice guy, really. But you must be so depressed if you just watch that. People don't like you. It's because they don't understand you, John, and you don't understand them. This is not an alternative culture. This is how it is. This is what it's like. So what better place to come than Glastonbury? You're tense, you're nervous, people hate you, you're feeling repressed, a little bit small. Come here, why not get a few pricks in you as opposed to around you and bring Douglas? It's about relaxing, it's about knowing yourself, it's about being confident. Look at it, John, that could be you and Norma. Think about it. What do you think of Tony Blair? Who's he? <laughs> <laughs> Can I just ask you a question? Yeah. What do you think of Tony Blair? Who's Tony Blair? Thank you. You've got to be really honest. What do you think of Tony Blair? It's better than John Major. Yeah, how much better? Not much He's the better. next Prime Minister. None of them really represent us, do they? He's the next Prime Minister out of the UK. Thank you very much. Thank Cheers. What do you think of Tony Blair? Oh, uh, right bollocks, isn't he, really? Expand your mind, John. That's the game. Come here, learn something that you didn't know before. I mean, look at this. Just look at this. Look at what this guy's done, right, with a load of steel. Just imagine if you'd brought your oil rig all the way up to Glastonbury. What would, Alan, what would people do? This is Alan, right? This is all your game, yeah? Yeah, yeah, with these other guys. Yeah. Right, if I bought you an oil rig, a massive oil rig, John, and gave it to you, what would you do with it? Uh, I'm not sure what sort of sculpture I'd do, but I think we could get some really big metal out of it. And you'd get a Maybe lot. Maybe a herd of elephants or something? Herd of elephants, John. A herd of elephants. A Douglas herd of elephants. So, John, come on down. You've seen the facilities. It's absolutely fantastic. Why don't you bring Norma? Bring Douglas. Don't worry about the traffic, because here I'm standing in the middle of what to you looks like a field, but in fact, it's a cleared space. It's a helicopter landing pad. 
why don't you bring the cabinet? Why don't you hire a fleet of helicopters and bring the Tory government? Because here, you will learn something. It's not necessarily alternative. It definitely is a part of the future. Come on down, darling. There's only one thing they haven't got here, and it's a lottery machine. So I've got to say this one thing. Joanna Lumley, will you please put my lottery numbers on? Thank you. Oh, and before we go, don't get too smug, Mr. Blair. Just don't get too smug. There you go, Keith Allen with the Glastonbury referendum. Now, uh, one of the highlights of these programmes, hopefully, is going to be our exclusive acoustic sessions on the specially constructed stage. Uh, you saw them earlier on on the NME stage, so here they are to perform acoustically just for us, Sleeper. I don't know anything about them. It is rude. They're here. They're here. Stop them playing. Well, they're here. Let's find out a bit about them. Right. They're a band Go and everything. Then. You do an interview. All right. Right, well, what's your name? Louise. All right. How are you? How are you? I'm all right. That's you pathetic. See? Look, no, that's no, how you do it. No. What, what, you what bands do you, you like? What are your influences? I hate all bands. Never mind all that. Like, if you're going to do an interview, let's have a proper interview. No, I can, I'll do the interviews. <laughs> Leave it to me. So, um, what was your name again? Louise. Louise, yeah. So, um, what were your favourite bands? Did, he say, did we get to that? Or? Partridge Family. Oh, Mark, the kids Mark, from Mark. Yeah. What? Let the kids play. Come on. Here we are. Sleeper. It's much too late at night 
for you, here for all. Little Annie said she knows. She knows what's happening. And like a woman, she explodes. She knows what's happening. She cut off the fingers to stop them from itching. She dug out her eyes to stop them from twitching. She's eating the dirt again like a monkey. She's flat on her back. Oh, yes, wasted and glad. Oh, yes, lost in her bed. She's gone around. Do you like red? Do you like green? Which of these colours do you prefer? Thank There's red, green, blue, yellow. Live and acoustic. We've you got Sharon Shannon later colours. on this stage. Yes. And we've also got more from okay, Oasis. And you. that's all coming up after the colours? break. Beige. So it's just you who've been sticking on the favourite colour subject. tonight but we've got another special slot for you um, with Oasis but the thing is I've run out of things to say about them. I know, well you want to read the Radio Times. <laughs> it's got, it's got uh, plenty of stuff about the bands that are on and everything and it gives good descriptions. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Manchester lads fronted by brothers Liam and Not. I shook his hand earlier. Yeah. Um, known for their love-hate relationship and classic rock pranks, hotel <laughs> room wrecking, <laughs> threatening reviewers, <laughs> brawling. <laughs> Oasis. 1994's
the brilliant Oasis, nice one. And uh, Noel, smart duffel coat our kid. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, sorry. My fault, I was completely... Nice one, uh, Mark. Yeah, I was completely in a different world there, if only. We're coming back tomorrow at uh, 3.40 for the first time with a million bands, and I can't remember they are either, to be honest. I can. The Shaman, Pulp, Smart. brilliant. Don't miss them. PJ Harvey, Top even one. better. Jeff Buckley, nice Orbital, one. of course, a big hit last Smart. year. Boo Radley, Spearhead, Jamiroquai, oh. and so many oh. more surprises for you tomorrow. That's you, it, that's it. Viewers. For you, the viewer, what she said then. Um, oh. I did promise we were going to finish off tonight with a live acoustic oh. session from Sharon Shannon, but uh, unfortunately she seems to have mysteriously disappeared in the famous Glastonbury Triangle, which is located precisely about here. It's well, not, somewhere. you know, the Glastonbury Triangle is over there. For God's sake, don't start that again. Not We've lost again. the bleeding triangle now. Oh. But uh, after the programme tonight, we were going to record Chuck Prophet, and we were going to put that into tomorrow's programme. So he's gamely agreed oh. to step into the breach. So we'll play out tonight round the campfire, formerly of Green on Red, Mr Chuck no, Prophet. Someone's nicked the campfire, you know? Oh, you're joking. <laughs> Walking out on the lost cause Well, that's not a sin Now it all comes flood back Every last lost weekend She dances alone Counts every step And she cleans up her cage She feels just like a kid Who looks twice her age like to bear witness, but she's probably just like The rules that we bent don't really apply to a long shot lullaby. Long shot lullaby. So out of focus, his lava took completely disappear And his mind walks away To quiet his nerves, he studies his hands Then did all those deeds he never, never will understand he Sings to himself, first graders rhyme The snow on the screen, it dances in time to wait Nothing so noble about having a past There's always some new kid who's got you outclassed I'm out on the road, run out of pride like some dispossessed king My telephone is deep in a coma in mine, I can't won't sing Look at myself and I feel like a spy I've got nothing to sell All I can supply is a long, long shot of the There's bones in the ground and there's stars in the sky The dance full again, the cheeks toss they cry at it
All right then. Well, on the outskirts of town, where we drive our stakes, we tie the campus down before the daylight breaks. You know the whereabouts, we send the barkers out, just as your town awaits. So grab a seat down front. Fire is your loud. Watch me swallow my sword to the delight. 